Hi, Debbie Nicholson speaking. Ooh, it's a bit chilly outside. The sun's trying to peep around the clouds, but oh, I'm not going out. I was going to go down to the beach, but however, I changed my mind and decided to hook up a lamp in here in my office in my bedroom and just hope that that is how it should be. Anyway, today I want to talk to you about getting out of debt. Now, it's very difficult to get out of debt if you're so far under that you can't see can't see the top of the hole that you've dug yourself into. Um, so I thought, well, it might pay for me to just have a little talk to you guys and see if I can help you with that. Um, first of all, you need to contact all those people. You need to ex acknowledge that you owe them money and you need to tell them, Look, I've written them all down, I've come to this point, this is how much I owe, and this is how much I can afford to pay you at this particular time. And some of them might be grumpy, but all you can say to them is, well, if you don't accept that, you'll get nothing, because I'll have to go bankrupt, and then things won't happen. How, you know, you won't get paid. So, I think that's what you need to do. You need to be um, sitting down and getting on that telephone. And just fronting up to the people and saying, well, this is how it's going to be from now on. Now, every week you get your pay. You've got to do your 10%, don't forget. That's always important regardless. Because the more you see that money growing in your account, the more confidence you'll get. Alright, in what you've decided to do. So then, don't forget that. And if you do pay tithing as well you've got to pay that 10 percent as well so you've got to budget out of your 80 percent that's left now i know you've got rent i know you've got food i know you've got a family to support um so you've got to work out how much you can afford to pay people back the debts that you owe and all you have to do is just decide all right i'm going to pay this much this week to such and such and um and this much this week to somebody else and just try and divide up what you've got left and amongst all the people pay them as much as you can and much as you have promised that you're going to pay them because you've already worked it out how you're going to do it all right it might take two or three years it doesn't matter how long it takes as long as you're still making a payment okay and then you need to go and take the money if it's too small to write amount to write a check or if it's too small an amount to use your F plus card, which I wouldn't advise anyway, because the bank takes fees, so you don't, you're really defeating the purpose doing it that way. Uh, if it was me, I'd go and get the cash and go and see the people. That's what I would do, because I think that that would be the best option. Um, anyway, do it how you wish, but I'm just trying to tell you what to do. All right, now once you've finished paying off one account. Don't think, oh, we're going to have a party now. We're going to go and get some beer in and we're going to have a celebration. That is not what you're going to think. What you're going to think now is all of that money you used to pay to that person at that time, you add it to the next urgent bill. So you're paying a bit more money. You, you've been without it anyway up till now. So... There's no harm in being without it for a bit longer. So what you do is add it to the next payment for the next urgent bill. And so that man's going to get a little bit more and he's going to be a bit happier with you. That's cool, isn't it? And then when you finish paying him off because you're paying extra now, you take the two lots of money and put it onto the next urgent bill so that you can pay that man off with three lots of money rather than just one. Now can you see where I'm coming from? This is how you're going to get yourself out of trouble now. It's not going to happen overnight. Because I don't know how much in debt you are. But you can get yourself out of it. If you just follow along what I'm trying to tell you. Alright. So this is day 24 that we're doing this video for. And I will talk to you again tomorrow.